The first time you open the app you will see the Docs section. Here you can see and manage all your documents. Tap on any of the documents to open it. Use two finger to pan and zoom the canvas. Let's go back to the Docs section and create a new document. Tap on the plus button and choose new document. One of the Graphio unique features is its shape recognition. Let's draw some shapes. See how Graphio is recognizing them, and closing them for you. This also happens when we draw connections. In the current version only straight connections are recognized. To make a different connection draw a straight connection first, then tap it and tap on the gear button, to access the shape properties. Choose angular connection. Sometimes a connection is automatically positioned in a different way than you want it. Tap the flip button to flip the connection. Access the connection control points to further customize where it connects to a shape. Or move its middle point to change how the connection looks. You can also select any shape and move, scale and rotate it. Simply drag to move. And use two fingers to scale and rotate it. For even better control tap a second time on selected shape to access the handles. Some shapes are impossible to be drawn. That's where our shape libraries come handy. We have a large and ever-growing variety of different shapes and libraries. Lots of them are free and even more could be bought from the shape store. To add a shape on the canvas simply tap, hold and drag on the canvas. Then treat them like any other shape on the canvas. Great. But what about text? Text is as easy to add as double tapping anywhere on the canvas, shape or connection. In addition to the vector shapes in the library you could also add images from camera roll. Let's see how we can style objects to make them look better. First select the object you wish to style then open the properties panel from the gear button. Choose the fill color you wish to apply to that circle. Do the same for the connection but this time choose the color from stroke. Let's also make the text purple. The style picker is very handy when you wish to get the style of another object to the selected object. Now all we need is a good looking pictogram and our diagram is ready. Let's just make it white by picking the style of the icon next to it.